Welcome back, dudes. So this has nothing really to do with kind of anything in the game right now. It could be a glitch on Bungie's end, but if you go to your vault right now, when you first look at it, you'll see all your primary weapons and every weapon showing the correct elemental affinity. However, if you go to the sort button and start clicking it and go over, you'll see some of the same guns, but they'll all have different elemental burns. So seeing that had me started, you know, to think, is this something going on behind the scenes at Bungie? Are they testing this? And with trials coming out, does this have anything to do with trials and maybe how it's going to be changing? Maybe certain weapons will have different elemental burns and if you use a specific subclass in trials, could a different elemental burn affect the shield maybe you'll have on in trials? You know, trials might change completely 100%. Like if you're using a solar subclass, you might have a solar resistant shield and take more damage from solar weapons. So by having that, that could negate, you know, all kinds of metas that are going on. People are talking about Arantel and just all these other guns that people are crutching on right now. Some guns will show multiple burns layered on top of each other. And I thought that was kind of interesting and I kind of wanted to know what all you thought about this and if you think it's just some kind of glitch going on with Bungie right now and just it doesn't really matter anything or could this be something that they're testing behind the scenes because this can be a complete game changer if they do change this to where you might have a primary patron of Lost Causes but it might drop with Arc or it might drop with Void or it might drop with Solar or it might not have anything at all because you'll see some of them such as that Hazard of the Cast at the top left. It doesn't even have a burn on it, but the one to the right has solar on it. So they could be making a change to where certain guns might drop kinetic, certain guns might drop, you know, solar, some might drop void, some might drop arc, and that would affect the overall damage. And in the crucible, like I was saying with trials, that could completely change how trials plays out. If somebody is in a void subclass, you can't rely on your Lunas Howl anymore or, you know, whatever gun you used to crutch on because it might not work as effectively because they're not using a solar subclass, which makes that weapon not as effective in that match. I don't know, a lot of things just kind of came to my thought, you know, I was thinking, you know, this could just be some kind of, you know, glitch that's in the vault right now, but at the same time, I don't see how this could be a glitch. It, you know, it could be something that they're just testing right now and they have to actually have it in the vault showing this way, even though it's not live in the game right now. This could still mean quite a bit of thing. And I want to know your thoughts on this and how you think this could play out. And if they're changing how this works in Master Nightfalls and things like that, or just any weapon at all. If you're trying to farm out God Rolls right now, it might be a great idea to test this by putting it in your vault, hitting the sort button to see what burn it actually is showing in the vault. And if you have one for Arc, you might want to get one for Solar too, or get one for Void, you know what I mean? Just to keep in your vault, because this might be a locked burn it could have. Or they might even make it to where Banshee sells different elemental burn mods every week. Kind of like how he sells different mods every week right now, or every day right now. So you might want to check this out before they actually lock all these guns the way that they are. And they're only going to be rolling one way. Or they could, like I said, they could roll any way. They could just stay kinetic. Or they could, you know, stay arc, or they could stay void, or, you know, it, there's a, a lot of possibilities that could be changing in the future that they're just not even trying to bring up now. And this could be a change that isn't happening for, you know, the next six months. It might just be showing like this in the vault right now, because they're doing beta tests on it right now, so it's just showing like that in the vault, but it's, you know, obviously not in the game. But next time you go to your vault, check and see what burn it's showing, and if you want to get that same roll, and if you want to get a gun using your fractal line stuff right now, you know, you can keep farming it out and try to get, you know, a good patron of lost causes and void with the same roll. I know that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm trying to get a solar arc and a void patron of lost causes with mulligan, a pended magazine, and explosive rounds, and then chambered compensator because I want to have one in all the elemental burns in case they're not able to be changed in the future or if they're going to be locked to a certain specific burn, but I have the burn right now that can't be changed later on. So there's a lot of grinding that you might want to start doing now to be safe later in case this all does change in the future they haven't mentioned anything about it and like i said this could be just a complete you know bug right now that's going on but at the same time it might not be and i don't see why it would even how that could even be a bug you know what i mean i think that there's probably some tests going on that we just don't know about yet and with the talk of trials coming out and you know all these metas they're worried about you know oh what's going to happen with last word and sniper combos or air Intel users you know everybody's just going to be using specific guns and trials is going to be the same crap that it used to be well it won't be like that if your subclass matters and how much damage you're taking on an elemental burn weapon you know what i mean solar subclass might be susceptible to solar damage but if you're using a void air Intel, you're not going to be able to hurt somebody that's in trials that's using a solar subclass so you can mix match and kind of balance out on a per team basis so collecting guns right now for those specific situations that could be happening in the future might be a great idea. But anyways, I'm not trying to make a mountain out of a molehill. I just kind of saw that. I wanted to bring it to all of your attention. So if you have a lot of guns in your vault right now that are showing random burns, you might want to check out and maybe collect some other kind of burns. Maybe have a kinetic and all the elemental burns of that same weapon with that same kind of roll that you can grind out. And as far as master nightfalls or, you know, PVE activities, 
this will be a huge game changer as well because there's a lot of master nightfalls that i can't use certain weapons but if i was able to go to banshee and then buy a new elemental burn to put on that weapon just for that week that'd be pretty sick and it's kind of like what it used to be before they changed it and made all these locked burn loadouts and you know things that the game has but anyways let me know what you think about in the comments below is this just a bug or do you think that there's actually some testing going on and this might have something to do with trials or you know whatever your thought is let me know what you think about it or if you've heard about this and it is a bug for sure let me know but anyways guardians thanks for tuning in i'll see you all in the next video next time in space